Well, the quest means many things. Um, the quest a few years ago is different from maybe what the quest is today, but a few years back I had a very, very difficult accident. I was at home, alone. I was dusting and cleaning, and in retrospect maybe I shouldn't have done that, because on the top shelf there was a very big ceramic sculpture which was very heavy, and as I was dusting at the bottom, I knocked it off the top shelf. So the ceramic pot hit me on the head, knocked me unconscious for a couple of, ooh, two and a half hours. And then it became um, important to me to get better. Um, the hospital said it could take six months to two years, and I guess probably after ten months I was starting to feel really good again. Um, but I wanted to get my hands into something, I wanted to do something creative because I've always been creative. So what was my quest then? I wanted to paint, I wanted to do something. So I wanted to get my hands into some colour, maybe into some paint. I've not done that before, even though I've been creative for many, many years. So I thought, hmm, how am I going to do that? And I found this fantastic book, which was called um, Brave Intuitive Art, or Brave Intuitive Soul. Um, and it said, get a blank canvas, get some paints, put your hands in it, and see what happens. And so that's what I did. And I started painting, finger painting, little scenes. And people said they wanted to buy them. And so, from finger painting, it progressed, and I thought, my gosh, I can paint, I can do things. I was told at school I was hopeless, and here I was as a mature lady thinking, this is something I can do and want to do. And I started painting um, mostly acrylics, uh, mixed media, watercolours, went on painting holidays, did so many things, built up a whole portfolio of art, and did um, prints as well, and a new life has opened up. And here I am today having many, many paintings and prints and um, I get to enjoy painting them but what is so really lovely for me is that someone looks at them and goes, my gosh, I've just got to have that in my home. And so what I've painted from my heart goes into somebody else's home with such joy and that's just so wonderful. I've always thought I'm a rainbow lady, I was born with a rainbow inside of me and those little rainbows are now all over the world.